this is M&B Films and in this video I am going to be showing you how to get free apps well, free app store apps and other apps using your computer your iPod touch alright so we're gonna start out all we gotta do is start it by turning it on alright so when it's on of course this already has to be jailbroken and this can be done with firmwares 2.1 and 2.2 possibly just 2.0 but since it can be jailbroken with higher firmwares, you might as well just upgrade and jailbreak. Alright, so you need to go in and enter Cydia. Alright, it's loading up here. Now, you're going to have to add a new source. So, wait till it's all done, or actually we could cancel out of it if we wanted to. It'll just take a while. Yeah, it, it just takes a while, even when you cancel and stuff. Alright, so it comes up and hit manage like I just did and go to sources. I didn't ex actually want to zoom in, but okay. You're going to go to edit, add, and type in a p t dot h a c oops c K E R S dot N L. You're gonna hit add source, but I already have the source added, so I hit cancel, then hit done. Now go down to it, it should look like here. Right this one, right there. When it decides to enter it. Yeah, it should be working. It's just slower. Alright. Now, you're going to go down to the P section. Alright. Patch mobile installation. Alright, right here is if you have 2.1. Right here is you, if you have 2.2. I have 2.2, so I click on this one. Once it loads up, you know, it's got the whole page. Alright, I already have it in, installed and stuff, but here's all I'm going to do is I'll just go modify and I'll show you, just reinstall. And confirm, make sure I have everything right. And it should install everything. Alright, now it's downloading all the information. almost done it's configuring since I do not believe you should be able to read that this process does take a little while so it shouldn't take more than a minute or two no matter like as long as you have a nice speed internet connection not like dial up or anything and then hit restart springboard Alright, that's the part that I show you on the iPod Touch so far. Now I'm going to plug you up into my computer and I will show you from there. Alright, now that we're in my computer, what I'm going to do is show you how you have to get the apps. Alright, so, well, you're just looking at what my background is right now. What you're going to do is you're going to go up to one of these sites. So, as you can see, we're at my homepage right now. We're going to go to one site here. This is, we're going to go to Appulus. I'll put the link in the description. Yeah, it should load up soon. Alright. And then, as you can see, it just loaded. Got all these apps here. We're going to go to one more site. There are plenty of sites, but yet you just have to go. Here's another one. Alright, I'm just going to, here we'll go to there. Download section. Alright, and we'll just... Let's just find what we want. Yeah, you just scroll through them. It, it actually has more information than what you can see. It's got the cross and then do a download link. Alright, let's see. Oh, here, we'll just get 
this one here, fart box position detection. All you got to do is, in this case, you go over here and click the download link. Then a box just like this pops up. And then all you're going to do is go into it and it'll say open with iTunes default. Hit OK. It should download fast like that. As you can see, it's downloading right now. Alright, and there we go, it's done. And it brings up my iTunes. Now hold on a sec. As you can see, you got tons of apps here. Here it is. Right here. Got tons of apps here. Then all you're going to do is have make sure your iPod is plugged in. So hold on a sec, and I'm going to plug in my iPod. Alright, it's booting up now. It'll pop up right around here. When it does, see, I'll just scroll through these, you know, got some fun apps here. I used to have uh, Nano, so I had a couple games for it. You know, okay, here we go. Made the sound, it should pop up soon. So, see, I got all these apps. I got most of these from sites like IPA, Repo, and uh, Appulus, actually from those two and then one extra one that's not as good it just has a few apps on it alright here we go here we go see as you can see Matt's iTouch space it's only 8 gigs for some reason it only has about 7 software version 2.2 .2. that's actually that's important as you can see I downloaded the 2.2 .2 mobile installation earlier okay for some reason this is taking longer than normal, but as you can see it says syncing. Ah, uh, yeah, it's backing up my uh, iPod right now. And then as you can see it says right there my app amount. I have 661.9 megabytes of apps. It's a lot of apps right now. I don't I don't have too much music on here right now. As, and then it says as soon as it goes in it says you'll You'll normally come down here and hit the sync button, but since it's synced up itself, just hit the sync button. You go up and it'll go here. So I'll just show you. Go here and hit sync. All right, and then this one's probably going to sync really fast. See, so it says it's syncing my iTouch, and then all right got that much and I'm gonna go back to my iTouch to show you the rest and playing it alright now that we've got the app synced up and installed on your iPod all you're gonna do now is take it unplug it actually you don't have to unplug it just turn it on here slide unlock and go to your page where it would be now don't worry I'll show you guys really quick I'm not new to this or anything I have just loads up. I have categories so I can keep my apps a lot more organized. As you can see, I'm not new to this. I have plenty of apps and I have a few different folders. That's just one of them. All right, see, we downloaded Fartbox, which is right there. It's a, it's a motion detector. Now, uh, I'm going to plug up the speaker to this, so I do not believe you'll be able to mess with it too much, but here we go. Alright, the speaker is plugged up, and now I'll just turn it up a little bit. Now what this does, you won't be able to see while I'm doing it too much, but here we'll turn it on. As you can see, all it does is it makes fart sounds when you twist it. Here, I'll go into this so you can just see the little animation saying put it in your pocket get in your comfortable position and then whatever and then do either one of these techniques to make it go off and make it sound like you're farting alright so as you can see all this worked downloading apps for free you can use any of those sites actually you can use any sites uh, I will have a couple of them listed in the description as I said before all you have to remember is they have to be IPA files alright thanks for watching remember to comment and rate and please subscribe.